everybody, welcome to another unboxing video. Today I'm going to be unboxing this massive box from Sir Toys. So, I hope everybody is well. I ordered this box about a week ago uh, via EMS. It's taking about a week um, for my deliveries to come through now, which I'm more than happy with. Uh, you know, that's plenty quick enough for my liking. Hopefully this should be something rather large. Flip this open. Oh. God, it's getting bigger and bigger. That's what she said. Hey, dum. And of course we get some randoms in there. <laughs> That's the KO version of the, what prime was that? The, the small kit that you could get with the interchangeable hands. Ah, uh, oh, it's gone off the top of my head, it's gone. We've got the knockoff-ish uh, Guardians of the Galaxy in there, along with some more awesome pieces. Ah, let's have a look. Ah, Minicon! <laughs> Cheers, Paul! Uh, let's start off. We've got a few uh, KO Masterpiece bits, because I just wanted to top up my collection. So we've got the KO version of uh, Streak S. It's the nice shiny silver one, which I'm going to paint the uh, bonnet on it black. If you don't know why I should paint it black, then shame, shame on you. And what else we've got here? We've got the uh, Lambo and Red Alert. Got those. And now for the big boys. These are made by Tai Kong Zan, I think it is. That's the, um, basically they're available in China and uh, kind of Malaysia and they're a uh, knockoff hugely oversized transformers from like Dark of the Moon and Revenge of the Fallen but they are done to an exceptionally high standard and here we go this is their version of Starscream and look at the size of that, I got this with the intention of hollowing out the cockpit and uh, getting the G.I. Joe slipstream and putting him in there and having it as a big crossover. I mean, this is massive. It feels fantastic. So looking forward to uh, reviewing that guy. And of course, I also got these accessories which go with uh, Star Screams Lot Tai Car. There's a huge gun to go with the other guy. Ah, yep, still works, still works. Uh, this other one is again made by the same manufacturer. Uh, I saw uh, Graham, the Collector 75's review on this, as well as uh, Marcus, my good friend Marcus uh, Cyberzoid, um, who reviewed this as well. And this is the hugely oversized version of Dark of the Moon Megatron. Again, made to an exceptionally high standard. There we go. Let's just give you guys an idea of scale. I've got a uh, G.I. Joe just here. There we go. That's uh, it's not bad, is it? It's not, not as close as I'd like, but it, it's certainly a lot better than the Voyager scale one. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got this time round. Uh, yeah, can't wait to get these out and review them. So until next time, goodbye.